Oh, hi everyone, Silas Silence here, and welcome back to 31 Days of Halloween. And today I decided to turn something cute, usually, into something menacing and evil and weird. Yes, I am an evil bunny. It would be probably pulled together a lot better with some bunny ears, but I don't have any. And I am broke, so therefore I will not be getting any. But, uh, overall, I really kind of like this look. I feel like it could be a little bit better, as always, but I'm very hard on myself as far as makeup goes. But, if you want to see how I created this look, please continue watching. And if you like this video, please leave a like, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And, here we go. Alright, so the very first thing I did is take some black water activated paint and I start sketching out the mouth. I wanted it to be like a little wavy and chopped up. Um, at least that's the best way I can describe it. So that's what I do first and then I go in and do the inner part. So that's kind of like the gums, the mouth, you know, like little black parts that animals have. <laughs> Hopefully you know what I'm talking about and I'm not just sounding like an idiot. Um, anyways, then I start sketching out the teeth and I just make them pointed and also rounded towards the top. And I do this for both the top and the bottom. The next thing I do was unnecessary at this point, but I accidentally did it already. I start sketching out the nose area and adding the dots. But the reason why it's uh, pointless right now is because now I go in with this brush and I start lightly putting on the white um, and making it look like fur. So just slightly flinging the brush across my face um, to give it a little bit more texture here in a second. I'll be doing the same technique with a tiny bit of black. Uh, not a whole lot. You want to do this very lightly just to give a little texture to the fur and then you're going to go over it again with white again. And it's okay if you mess up your lines on your mouth and stuff. You kind of want to blend that in together. Um, and now I redraw out the nose and the little dots. And I made a boo-boo so I just fix it, wipe it off a little bit and fix it. Uh, next, I paint in the gum area with black. And then I use the black to start sketching out the eyebrows and I'm just drawing lines going off of each other. So it's more like a feathered effect for the eyebrows. Because I'm such an angry evil bunny. Uh, next, I am going in with a mango mixed with um, flu. It's F E L O U. I mixed those two together to get this yellowish color to paint in the teeth. The next thing I do is I am taking Porto. Uh, it's a red color. I mix that with a little bit of black to put in between the teeth to give a really dark red. And then I'm taking regular red and I'm just putting a little bit on the tips of the teeth like blood. And then I'm taking pink and I am painting in the nose. And then I'm taking the black again and I'm drawing little lines coming out from the mouth and lines that connect to the eyes and I'm painting um, basically like eyeliner on top and the bottom of my eyelids. Next I am taking some pink eyeshadow and I'm just shading in on my eyes and pulling that out a little bit from the eye. 
on the top and the bottom. And now I'm going in with the pink paint and drawing some character lines and I'm also going in with a little bit of black and doing the same thing on the top and the bottom of the eye. Uh, that's pretty much how I created this evil bunny look. If you liked the way this turned out, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more videos to come soon. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.